What's up guys? Welcome back to Japan. It is another lifestyle and culture video. I'm here again with Kalen. You remember his super sexy Orange Mark IV. We're both hungry. Uh, we're at a place called Arashi's. Uh, they make like some of the best fried rice and the best ramen you could dream of. It's pretty awesome. We're gonna check out how you buy food, how you order stuff. Let's so see what they got. Probably my favorite one so far. Oh yeah, I'm excited. Guys, yeah, give a shout out to Spencer for recommending this place. The object here is to put your money here and then choose what you want. So they got you know, ramen, gyoza, yeah, pizza, if you want. It has everything has a price. It looks like fried ice. 290 yen. They give you these little tickets. You come out here and you hand the tickets to the workers and they make your food. So let's see what we want to eat. And if the pictures on the little machine here are too small, you can get bigger pictures on the menu here. And they it's have. in English. And it's in English. So you can kind of figure out what we're buying. I don't know, man. It all looks so good. I think I might be doing some fried rice today. I think, I think so. So we already ran into a snag. All we have is 5,000 yen, and it only takes 2,000, 1,000. So we're see if we can get some change real quick. Solve our issue so we can eat because we're dying. So it's pretty awesome. They hooked us up. They're going to give some change. I guess uh, it must be a common problem. <laughs> Are you dying, man? I'm so hungry. The way out of the place though, they got the Japanese style booths and regular booths along with the bar. Oh. Oh. Arigato. All right, let's go ahead and put in the uh, put it in first. Yeah. So ten thousand. He was going with the. I think yours right that. I'm going oh, with this. You're going. Oh, okay, you're going shrimp. Boom. Spits it out. And uh, I think we get to put. You want some. some goza? Yeah. Get it eight. Yeah, that's good. Yep. Boom. Now. I'll have to put my money in. And it's funny. Because we are getting basically the exact same thing. My tickets. So this is you hand this to the workers. And they, uh. Make your food for you. You gotta figure out where we do it. So we get to sit at any table. We chose this lovely one. And if you look, you can see the Supra right outside. Gotta it's important. It. You gotta keep an eye on it, right? <laughs> what do you think about this place, man? I'm interested. This looks good. It's authentic. So, one of the unfortunate things about Japan is they always give us these tiny little cups. I don't. It seems like one sip. <laughs> I already I'm super, finished my And I'm super thirsty. <laughs> Luckily, we have this to refill for our thirsty asses. What's your favorite thing about living in Japan? Car scene. <laughs> Obviously. Car scene? Yeah. <laughs> the car scene out here in Okinawa is phenomenal. If you haven't seen the channel, you gotta check it out. There's some incredible cars in here. Uh, we just did a video with his car uh, over at Up Garage, and I think we had 11 showed up, an uh, Evo showed up, a uh, slammed Honda S2000 in the LNC showed up. And then two really clean Civic hatches were there. It's amazing. That was just a regular day. Nothing was planned. You see legends every day. Though. It's nuts. I know, right? I'm, it's funny because I still get excited about it, but I am a little desensitized to it. So I'm not as excited yeah, as, yeah. I, as I once was. When I first got here, I was like, oh my gosh, yeah. You're going to go back to the stage, so I know. And it's going to be like, man, where are all the, exactly. where are all the JDM cars? Oh, gosh, yeah. <laughs> so we've been waiting for a while now. We're seeing all these other people get their food. Getting hangry. I think they forgot about us. I think so, might be. Oh, here it oh, is. Oh, here we go. Perfect timing. Woo! That looks amazing. Is this okay? That's perfect. Oh, awesome. Ooh, that sounds good, doesn't it? How do we get the one? So it's here. I guess all we had to do was complain about it and it shows up. So I went with the shrimp fried rice. 
so they got some eggs on it. Some soup. Oh, this looks so good. I'm about to dig in and see the steam. What are you thinking, man? I'm thinking it looks so good. It smells even better. <laughs> it's, dude, it looks so good. Let's shout out, man. And they give you shovels to you. That's what we need. How they do? My God. Look at the size of the spoon. Oh my, there's two of them. This is amazing. Let's do it. Oh, it smells so good. Vincer, <laughs> thanks, bro. That's a great idea, dude. So, it was delicious. Obviously, there's nothing left. The soup was good. The gyoza was good. Oh my goodness. What do you think, man? I mean, we crushed it. Man. You ready to go, dude? You yeah. ready to go? Food is good, but I need to get back to my car. Yeah. <laughs> it was awesome. Really, really cool environment. God, look at the light hitting that Supra. It, it's such a beautiful If you've not seen this car, you gotta check out the video I did for this of Red Up Garage. Take it for a little joy ride, some cool sounds. This thing is gorgeous. I love the fact that it's the same exact uh, paint code as the uh, Fast and Furious Supra. Same bumper, same hood. He put his own taste on it with the wheels. The CCWs look great on there though. You don't see any CCWs out here in Japan. Before we go, we wanna come out here and see if we can get some uh, car spotting on. I know the Supra is beautiful and all, but we'll see what else we can find. We have a Lancer on Evo. It says Gallant. It does say Gallant. What the? I guess that's a Gallant. Over here? I'm not sure. There's Jeremy. Yeah. A little S15. I'm a thumbs up for that, man. Nice. Oh, I got some damage on it, but I still rock it. Love those S15s. While we were car spotting, we saw something that caught our eye. Check out this WRX from Garage Neo. This thing is wild. I'm not a fan of graphics normally, but this car kind of pulls it off. Really yeah. Hey, if you guys in the comments could tell me what model has a little roof vent, I'm very curious. Cause I, I've seen it before, I'm not sure what it is. Let me, let me know in the comments. I'd really, I'd really like to figure that out. Oh, look at this. Ah, cool stuff parked everywhere. Got a JZX100 Chaser. And 11, nice. Those of you who know the Chaser has a 1JZ in it. But this 11, man, this thing is sick. Yeah, it's gutted, it's got some spare wheels in the back. <laughs> this thing is awesome, man. Look at that gigantic tack. Hitting the streets. That's awesome, man. I don't know if anybody cares about this little Mini. I think it's the Mini S, so it's supercharged. Probably a lot of fun to drive. I mean, I'm not a huge fan. Maybe if I lived in England, but... And look here, we have a Cresta. All these mid-90s Toyos are pretty cool. All right, guys. That's going to wrap it up for this week's video. Uh, we're done here at Arashi's. We're stuffed. The environment was cool. The food was amazing. The machine that you ordered from was pretty cool. You know, like, you never see stuff like that in the States. So I want to give a shout-out to uh, Kalen. Appreciate him coming out. I'll put his Instagram right here so you can uh, check out and follow the Supra. See all his future endeavors. But thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. And as always, I'll see you next time.